Look, the knights have come back! I'm innocent, I tell you! This is a plot by the knights to destroy the council! He doesn't know when to quit, does he? Where's Flynn? Uh, I can't make him out from here. You must not be taken in by the knights! They only plan to crush this town once you've all been lured into a false sense of safety! On the honor of the Imperial Knights, I swear that we would never perpetrate such disloyalty. You're... Flynn Shifo! The Empire and the Union have joined in a treaty of friendship. What? Impossible! At this moment, Don Whitehorse and His Highness Yoder are in council together. It's only a matter of time until it's made official. But how? I thought that cursed Alexei was tied up in other matters. Yes. It is true that our Commandant could only make a brief appearance before returning to the capital. Then, on whose authority? No! This can't mean my plans have been ruined by this... this boy! This will put an end to the suffering of the people of Capua Nor as well. Here's hoping the next magistrate they get is more of a stand-up guy. I will do what I can to make sure a worthy person is chosen when I get back to the castle. To the castle? You mean you're going back to the capital, Estelle? Yes. With Rago gone, the rest of the castle should have returned to normal. But you don't really want to go back. What do you mean? I can see it in your face. No, I... I... Well, you should do what suits you best. You've made up your own mind, right? I will go back. I don't want Flynn or anyone else to have to worry about me anymore. It's gonna be lonely without her, won't it, Repeat? Oh, man. Just let me sleep. Brigo! He... he... What did Brigo do? They say he used his standing in the council to reduce his charges! It looks like he's gonna get off with only a minor drop in rank after everything he did! This has got to be a joke. It's not a joke! It's the truth! So this is how the Empire works now, huh? Damn it, this is not funny. What do we do, Yuri? Hmm. I don't know. How can he not get punished? Wait, if we tell Estelle, maybe she can do something about it. Hey, don't go giving the princess too much trouble. Damn it. What's Flynn doing anyway? I wonder if he's at his post right now. Doesn't anyone knock anymore? 
You knew I'd be coming. That outfit. As of today, I've been assigned the post of captain. So, the birth of the Flynn Brigade, huh? Looks like I've been one-upped again. If that's how you feel, you should come back to the Knights. You'd be able to... Don't waste your breath. Congratulations on making captain. Thank you. You didn't come down here to celebrate my promotion. No, I didn't. It's Rago, isn't it? Appropriating Nor Harbor for his own purposes, committing treason by his collusion with Barbos. Add to this stealing from the populace and the extermination of even his own people simply because he didn't like them. The people he killed were either fed to monsters or sold to those who will pay money for corpses. Sick bastard. That he should be able to do those things and not have to answer for them. The authority of the Council is far more powerful than I'd imagined. I thought with this promotion to Captain that I'd gotten a bit closer to my goal. But I have to face the fact that the law can't even punish a single person like Rago. You know it doesn't end here. You'll climb even higher until you can make the right changes. True. But many people will continue to suffer in the meantime, needlessly. When I consider that, I... Don't go flying off the handle and smacking him around. The progress you made would all be for nothing. <clears throat> if he's above you, you go even higher, and then... Yes. Someday I'll create a legal order that treats everyone with equality. I have to. Good. And I'll do things my own way. Yuri? How would you go about punishing the villains that the law can't touch? I'm still trying to figure that out. It seems I may have gotten a little careless when I thought Alexei wouldn't be around. Flynn Shifo, that impertinent upstart. This is a grudge I won't soon forget. I will bring down the full authority of the Council on you. Ah! What the? It's you. Do you intend to harm me? I'm a member of the Council, you know. I could crush you w with a single command. You won't get away with this. The laws in the Council may have let you go, but I'm afraid I can't do that. Ah, st stay back! Oh, I was so close. De nomos. Repeat. We gotta split up. Please, come visit the castle anytime. You'll really come if you say that. What? Didn't she just invite me? Huh. Idiot. With the treaty, it'll become easier for guild members to enter the capital. That's right. Princess, we should be going. Oh, yes. I promise to do what I can about Rago to see that he gets the punishment he deserves. 
Princess, you should know. What? You see... Lord Brago has not been seen since last night. We do not yet know the details. These whereabouts are being investigated as we speak. What could this mean? Maybe he got scared and ran away. Well, I guess I'll be going too. I want to check out stuff like those air credits. When I finish my analysis, I'll, um, pay a visit to the capital too. I'm looking forward to it. Uh, okay then, see ya! Carol, where will you go from here? I want to start up a guild with Yuri. That sounds like a good idea. Your Highness. Sorry, I'm ready now. Shouldn't I go get Yuri? No. I wouldn't want to wake him. All right. Well, this is it. Yeah, I hope we see each other again. Yuri, are you awake? Estelle and Rita already took off. Oh. If you hurry, you might still be able to catch her. I can meet them anytime I want. Jeez, Yuri. Fine, if that's how you're gonna be. Even if I did go, it would just make it harder for them to leave. Monsters. Yuri! Carol, any idea what that thing is? No, I've never seen anything like that before. It's coming down! Come on, Carol. What? Hey, wait! Just when I get to relax, I get dragged into another mess. Yuri, fate really is out to get you. Hey, it's not all my fault. You had a role in this too. But I never ran into gigantic monsters or got arrested by knights before I met you. Well, things didn't go bad for me until I left the capital with Estelle. So that means... Drop it. Keep moving. R right. going on here? Yuri, protect her highness! Yuri, look! This way, foul fiend! Why is it just ignoring us? Is it coming for... me? The Commandant, but why is he here? Our finest knights. I am left with no choice. We will stop this beast with the help of Heracles. Yuri, wait! There's nothing more you can do! <laughs> you expect me to stand by while that thing makes a snack out of Estelle? The insipid poison of this world must be purged. It can speak! Who... who are you? You're safe. What 
is that? Heracles! Whoa! We gotta get out of here! I'm going to leave the city and continue my journey. What do you mean? If you're going back to the capital, you shouldn't keep Flynn waiting. It's for you to decide. Then I... Now that's what I wanted to hear. Judith? Don't! It's too dangerous! Look who's talking. I'll be fine. You go on ahead. Come on, quickly! My, you're a stubborn one. Huh? Why is it taking off? Yuri! Lady Estelise! Wait! Here comes the cavalry. I'm sorry, Flynn. I realize now I can't just go back to the capital. There are too many things I still need to know. Surely after returning to the capital, you can... The voices of the people suffering in Nora Harbor never reached the capital. I won't achieve anything if I'm not willing to approach these problems head-on. I've come to realize that during my travels. That's why. That's why I have to keep going. Your Highness! Flynn, get this core back to the lower quarter. Yuri! I won't be going back to the capital anytime soon. I'm going to start up a guild. Give my regards to Hanks and everyone else. Yuri! A guild? So that's what you meant by doing things your own way? Yeah, I finally made up my mind. That's fine, but what about Princess... Take care, Flynn. Yuri! I suppose I should have talked to you first, but here's to our new guild, Carol. Right! Alright, let's go. If we hang around here much longer, some of those knights are bound to come after us. Huge flying monster actually talked, right? You ever heard of a monster like that? I've never seen or heard of anything like that. I don't think anybody in the Hunting Blades has. Man, first that thing at Karabakram and now this. The world's just full of surprises. I don't care how many lives you have, it wouldn't be enough to fight that thing. Yeah, not even I feel like taking on a monster like that. the guy we met at Cave Mock. Hello? <clears throat> and here Estelle's being so nice. Somebody needs to work on their manners. You're one to talk, Yuri. Hey, that monster's gonna attack us again if we keep wandering around here. Yes, you're right. You were the target of his attack? What? Uh, oh, yes. Um, do you know what he meant by insipid po- <laughs> What, is that your pet or something? We follow the same course of action. What, you're doing the same thing as a monster? Then does that mean you've come here to attack me too? My blade does not exist to pass sentence on humans. How odd. He has taken his leave. But why? Uh. Perhaps I am mistaken. No.
That guy still doesn't make any sense. What do you think he's up to? Who knows? Hey, we don't have time to just hang out here and enjoy the scenery. Oh yeah, we gotta go!